I was born in a family of relatively middle class. We were really asked to choose for ourselves, choose our values, choose what we were going to do. And that was the act of tolerance. My father actually had opened an account at the local bookstore for us, where we could go and buy thousands of rupees worth of books. So education was really the top priority. I really wanted to basically use my knowledge to ameliorate poverty. Women, there is a acute sense of struggle which I have felt in India and here. In 1955, I got a fellowship to go to Harvard. And that was my liberation. I was away from India and from everyone, 10,000 miles away. I sort of found myself. I think Indian men do not realize how difficult it is for a woman to get prominence in India of any kind, academic, literary, politics. So it's been almost 60 years now since we first met. 